Red's Iowa Train videos here. I'm just north of Hampton, Iowa, September 5th, 2022. And we got this Union Pacific spine line here. It's got a derailment here. Just north of Hampton. So I'm gonna put the drone on it now. We got the drone in the air above it. It's the only way to get to this uh, derailment really is by drone right now. It's pretty remote. So this derailment happened at 3.30 in the morning and I just got wind of it here about two hours ago. A buddy of mine said, hey, you looking for some content in your channel? I'm like, derailment? So I'm about 170 foot above these guys right now. And, yeah, I don't think there's much for hazmat. There's a lot of equipment up here. Looks like it's got the rail tore up pretty good. It's a big derailment. Yeah. Hey, no problem. Yeah, that's quite a mess. I'm gonna get up closer to there where all that, all that's piled up. Oh boy, they got a lot of work ahead of them. Oh boy, look at all that rail tore up. It looks like a lumber, it looks like a, a center beam car maybe. Yeah, wow, what a mess. So you can't get to this. The drone's really the only way to get to this thing. So they've been at it for, uh, well this happened at 3.30 in the morning. So I'd say they've been making some pretty decent progress. Here's their demolition filled, whatever you want to call this mess. I hear an airplane in the vicinity, but I'm not very high. I'm only 180 foot, so. Oh boy, they had a lot of lumber on this one. Look at all the center beams. There's a lot of, there's a lot of center beams on it here, so it's a, it's quite the mouse. How you doing? I didn't. You got a drone? Really? You wanna see it? Yeah. Here's the debris fill. So that's where they're, all their equipment is. Oh, there's a manned aircraft. You should be you should be too low low. I mean you can tell you there's airplanes around. Oh yeah? Oh here we're going north right now.
out. Right. good there is that the back of the train I'm guessing that's the back that must be the back of the train so all right well, as I came in the locomotives are set in north of here. oh I thought they're sitting south of here there's a trim part of the train set south of here but the locomotives are set right up here oh okay on the side. got my legit license so I can do this for money now if I want. I did the part 107 unmanned aircraft license. But this is just for fun in my YouTube channel, Reds Iowa Train Videos. There you go. You got a front row seat right there, man. You're a lucky guy. Cool. I'm a train nut. Yeah. I'm gonna get back the other I'm gonna get back the other camera. So that's how I do my audio. This won't record my voice, so I'll get back over here so that people can hear me. But, but yeah, that's uh that's quite the mess. I'm gonna take a Funny, but this is like wow. That's a mess. I like to back to my camera so I can see some audio. But yeah, there's the three wheels. That's their cleanup zone where they're gonna put all the junk. Boy, there's a lot of center beam, a lot of lumber. That's all lumber right there. Somebody's gonna get a deal on two by fours. Did you see down by Carlisle when they dumped that one? No, I didn't. Where's that at? south of Des Moines there was lots of wood that they just buried really they buried a bunch of lumber after the derailment and it's like as expensive as it is you go wait why don't you just tell people to come get it well I think the railroads a lot of times they it's all insurance and it's all paid for pretty much when that stuff's wrecked it's pretty much a loss from what I understand you know automobiles all that you get those auto racks and it just messes them up at all i think they're considered a total loss and then you might be able to auction them or something maybe maybe what's your website again reds iowa train videos reds you youtube iowa reds iowa train videos okay it probably won't be up for a week or so but i might rush this one good to talk to you yeah you too have a good one well there's the bridge right there I, Got away from the camera for a while. There's a couple of locos there wanting to know what was going on. Well, I showed them with the drone here. So, yeah, it's a, uh, it's quite the mess. I'm not sure if the bridge went out or if the train derailed and took the bridge out. So, yeah, it's a, uh, wow. Wow, look at that one there. Look at that tank car there submerged like that. Holy moly. That looks like looks like oil or something. Could be ethanol. Hard to say what it is. Yeah, it's my first derailment. 3.30 in the morning, so... Looks like they got hazmat inspector guys right here yet. These probably, these guys here are... I'm not even above them. I'm a ways away from these guys off to, so all the, I'm not really even directly above most of this. I'm off to the west of it. It's a nice thing about the zoom on this drone. You don't have to necessarily be right above people, so. 
you can uh, zoom in on the action. Yeah, that is quite the mess. Trying to see what the hazmat is on these, what was in them. See if we got any. I don't see a hazmat on that one, so that must mean it was empty, maybe. I'll tell you what, you wouldn't ever get to this without the drone. This is a remote spot, and uh, yeah, so that's their that's their work field. Now I'm heading back south again here. Might have to get back here shortly for the battery, but I might come back, land or put another battery and go out again because I've never gotten footage like this and I just rode for over an hour to get and see this, so. Yeah, look at that, I just ripped the rail right up. Yeah, the spine line's a pretty busy line. This was originally a Rock Island line, and the Chicago Northwestern acquired it off the Rock Island back in the 80s. And then Union Pacific acquired it from the CNW in 95, and the CNW had already done a lot of work to this line. They, uh, a lot of welded rail. They did the connection down at Nevada, Iowa, the Iron Cross. So, yeah, so they did a lot of the heavy work for the Union Pacific. The Union Pacific inherited something that was in pretty good shape when they got it. Over here we got our sections of track. Zip rail or pre-made rail, I'm not sure what you, what you call it. I think I saw some sections of track here. I think most of these trucks are probably hauling equipment. 